Hey guys, how you doing? Austin here. So real quick, wanted to come to you and talk to you about a situation that I'm seeing developing around Shiba Inu, Shiba Inu, that's weird, Shiba Inu related to a uh, burn mechanisms that are going into place. There's been a 25,000% increase in community burns in the last couple of days, 25,000. It was a number that was big enough that I needed to make a video to really kind of talk to you about that and to kind of uh, have an overall burn discussion with you. We all know that for us to reach uh, one penny in a couple of years that we need to do really two things. We need to add more holders. So we need to get north of 3 million holders who hold uh, Shiba Inu actively. And we also need to, um, well, there's really three things, right? That we also need to uh, burn or have a certain amount of the overall supply that goes away. And, uh, and so that's really what the main point of this video is. And then really the third thing that really I'm not going to address in this video, but I do think that the Shiba Inu team is doing is continue to execute on the ecosystem, continue to execute on all the things that they are going to bring to us. The game, the metaverse, um, uh, you know, Shiba Swap version two, Shibarium layer two scaling solution, all those different things. Okay, so let's go back to burns. 25,000% increase in community burns in the last three or four days. That was an insane uh, number as far as percentage gains. And it just, it just really highlights the communal effort of actively trying to move burns forward. Also remember that there is a burn portal coming from the Shiba Inu team themselves. Um, and we don't have a definitive date on that. And then in that burn portal, this is gonna be a portal from Shiba Inu where you'll be able to go and burn Shiba Inu if you so choose. But they're also gonna have some type of a reward mechanism built into that where you will be rewarded for burning Shiba Inu. Pretty darn cool. Now, let's switch real quickly and talk about kind of the overall burn situation as it relates to kind of communal and uh, burns that are gonna be coming from the teams themselves. Okay, so the burns coming from the community, we've addressed that, we've talked about that. We'll see that number ebb and flow, spike and go down over time. But we really need a burn mechanism built into the ecosystem itself. Those are coming. We know that there are going to be um, utility burns or burns that'll happen on a transactional level associated with Shiba Inu, specifically in two scenarios, Shiba Swap and on the Shibarium Layer 2 scaling solution. We know that those are going to be coming. And there's different hypotheses out there that do show that we could be burning up to even over 100 trillion Shiba Inu a year just through these two scenarios, Shiba Swap and uh, Shibarium, if we were burning, say, 1% of the total transaction flowing through those respective um, scenario, Shiba Swap and or Shibarium, over 100 trillion. That's a pretty significant number that will add up over time. Now that has not come to come out yet. Both of those, uh, Shiba Swap's out, but Shiba Swap B2 is coming and Shibarium's not here yet. So these are all things that I really wanted to kind of lay out for you. It's really a good kind of um, outline and, and, and gives you kind of a, a picture of what the landscape will look like from communal burns to utility burns that are coming from the dev teams themselves. So with all that said, Truly appreciate you. I wanted to, but uh, just wanted to come to you and kind of give you a, an update of what I'm seeing kind of on the burn front. Beyond that, if you haven't already done so, hit that subscribe button down below. I'd love to have you stick around and become part of the community. As always, I appreciate you and thanks. I'll see you later. Bye.